In this Illustrator tutorial, we're going to take a look at how to scale corners. You might notice that when you scale some designs up and down, the corners do not scale with the design. And that can make for some really different looking out of proportion designs compared to what you originally thought you had. So this square on the left and the square on the right, they both have a corner radius of 20. But as I scale this square up, you can see that that corner radius of 20 stays the same, so it really doesn't mean as much as I scale it up to this size. If I want to retain the actual nice rounded shape here, even as I scale it up, I need to select that shape, go to the transform window in my properties panel, click the three dots and select scale corners. Now when I scale this shape up, it keeps the corners in proportion. So this shape stays the same as I scale it up. And you can see the massive difference between keeping that corner scaling and not scaling. So this is going to be a 20 point corner still, which is what I had before, but I made that 20 points based on the size of the shape. So this one here, since it's scaled proportionally, is actually 120 points now because those corners scaled up. Now the strokes also scaled. You might have noticed the three dots. I can scale the strokes and effects as well. You can decide to have either of these turn on or turn off. There are actually reasons to uh, have one or the other, just depending on what you're designing. But that's how you can scale corners here in Adobe Illustrator.